I've come along today to visit the guys at Sparshot College who are working on a Chelsea exhibit being sponsored by Thompson & Morgan. I'd like to see exactly what the guys have been getting up to and I'm told they've been really busy with the plants. Chris, good to see you again. So tell me a bit about the theme of this year's garden. Yeah, this year we're teaming up with Thompson & Morgan and so we're doing Behind the Genes, so have a look at the breeding milestones. And it's quite exciting because we're in the discovery section at Chelsea Flower Show. How many gold medals are you on now, Chris? Uh, believe it or not, we're on eight uh, gold medals and five best in categories. Excellent. And what plants have you got on gearing up ready for the show this year then? Uh, well, we've got our main themes and having a look at particularly plant introductions and some of the exciting ones are the clematis. So we've got Coconoe, a lovely uh, blue, uh, more traditional clematis, but what is amazing is it starts as a single flower and then over the season develops into a double flower. Well, the theme of this year is uh, plant breeding and that's here behind the genes. We're learning about how the plants have been bred over the years. We went up to see Thompson and Morgan the actual headquarters and how the plants are packaged and how they're delivered to the customers. It was very interesting. It made us understand what effort it goes into producing plants like this as well. So it's been nice to learn about the breeding process that goes on behind bringing a plant to market. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I really, I really enjoyed it, and it's you know it's a great opportunity to go to go and see Chelsea. What are you up to here then? Just pricking out the Dahlia fireworks for this show into nine centimetre pots. Nice, and these are going to be actually on the stand at Chelsea? Yes, they will. They sent us over the seeds and now we're just propagating them ready for the show. Now this one here looks like a bit of a familiar face. What have we got here then? This is Helianthus Sunbelievable, which has been bred by Thompson & Morgan and is the first multi-flowering sunflower to be ever produced. Um, it came third last year at Chelsea as plant of the year and we're showing it again this year. It's a really interesting stand with lots of new varieties and also just showing the history as well, which has been really interesting. We take watering very seriously. It's a real fine art, so we, man we monitor the plants daily for their watering requirements. There's a lot going into the growing the plants, ready uh, for the show. Yeah, we're growing hundreds of plants and they're at different stages, and so their watering requirements are different. And only a few weeks left to go. I know, and there's going to be a lot of watering before then. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. 